Hey guys, what's up? Today, I want to review one of my favorite slasher movies of all time. This is my favorite slasher movie. And my third favorite horror movie of all time. And it's John Carpenter's Halloween. Yes. Now, this movie is absolutely brilliant. Um, I totally love this movie too much. Yeah, it's just a... It's, um, Probably one of the greatest independent horror film horror films in movie history, which I heard of. <laughs> um, so yeah, um, this was the movie that like started the slasher genre. Like after this movie, we got a lot of slasher movies. After that, like we got um, Friday Thirteenth, uh, Rosemary's Killer, Maniac, The Burning. You know, a lot of those movies. You know. Like, um, after this movie, especially in the 80s, the beginning of the 80s, they began, like, doing a lot of slasher movies, and when, after Halloween came, the slasher genre was begin, begun. But, you know, we have a lot of slasher movies that came before this, but this was the movie that, like, started it all. Uh, but um, they always called, like, Black Christmas as the first slasher movie. Now, uh, yeah, I would also say that, but, you know, Texas Chainsaw Massacre came actually before Black Christmas. Uh, but, I really, I'm not going to talk about that now. Um, we, like, getting out of, I, I like getting out of the review now. I have to review the movie. <clears throat> so, what this movie is about, um, well, it begins um, with... Um, Michael, as a little kid, he um, kills his sister, um, and then they cut to uh, some years later, in 1978, uh, where um, Dr. Loomis and some a nurse, I think, I'm not sure, um, driving a car, and uh, they go into the mental institution, and um, like uh, gonna meet Michael Myers, and when they come there, uh, all the um, the uh, all these uh, people who you know like like the patients, they they were like walking outside of the uh, men mental institution, and uh, <coughs> Michael he um, he steals the car and uh, he uh, drives away, so he escape from the mental institution and it comes back to um oh what was his name again Haddonfield yeah he come back to Haddonfield and <clears throat> and gonna f find um uh, Laurie Strode uh, who is uh, the little sister to Michael <clears throat> and um so yeah, Dr. Loomis, he comes back to Haddonfield and try to warn everybody that Michael Myers is loose and that they have to be careful to lock the, lock the doors and all that. But the problem is that it's Halloween, you know, and kids, they're going outside getting candy and all that, and, you know, uh, you know, and, yeah, and uh, of course, um, Michael Myers, he could be everywhere. Uh, so he's he uh, kills some uh, babysitters and all that and then <clears throat> one of the best scenes in the whole movie is of course um, when he's chasing Lord Strode um, so yeah this movie is very good um, a lot of people say it was pretty boring but because it was so little blood and all that um, I mean um, you know it doesn't have to be blood it was very little blood you know if you look, look at maniac that that movie still holds today but this movie wouldn't hold but i see a lot of viewers uh re like uh, people who uh, does movie reviews i almost everybody i've seen on youtube love this movie so uh, i really don't know of anyone who hates this movie um so yeah it's a very good one but it's it's very Creative kills like the one when uh, Michael likes hang up that guy with a knife on the chest. I think that was a pretty good one. 
uh, but the other ones like what well, he was um, uh, hanging them like yeah but uh, I really did like that kill so one of my favorite kills I can think of um, so yeah th this is my favorite slash movie and my third favorite horror movie of all time um, <clears throat> I thought the sequel was pretty good but there was a lot of things I really didn't like with the movie but it was good um, the third movie it wasn't bad um, but I thought it was very slow and a little bit boring but um, you go through it you think it, you know it's okay uh, you know it's not the worst movie ever now it's almost like uh, Fight 13th Jason wasn't in his first one and I didn't care I just want to see a slasher movie you know and I didn't care if Michael Myers wasn't in Halloween 3 either but the biggest problem that bothered me was actually that they watched the first Halloween on TV that kinda bothered me um, it was like Halloween 3 was like in real life and the Halloween 1 and 2 was just the movies you know uh, the fourth one I actually thought was pretty good uh, the return of Michael Myers I didn't like the mask uh, it was kinda rare in a in one way um, uh, uh, Halloween 5 Revenge of Michael Myers I thought sucked uh, really bad acting uh, Donald Pleasant he was overrated uh, I think he yeah. Uh, the movie was just dumb. I think they could just pass that one out. And uh, I really hated the ending. So we got Halloween 6, which I thought was okay. Um, and then we got Halloween H2O, which I thought was actually brilliant. Um, maybe a little bit overrated, but I thought it was pretty good. Halloween Resurrection sucked ass. I think a lot of people agree with me agree with me with that um, and so we have a remake of, uh, directed by Rob Zombie that was pretty good I loved the first um, uh, the first begin well the beginning of the movie uh, where all these scenes when we see uh, Michael as a kid and all that when he was in a mental institution and I did like when he was uh, a little bit older, wearing this uh, mask he had made himself, and you know, began to kill some people, and he got loose. Um, I really like that. But when he came to Hanfield, taking on his mask, it was like just seeing a rehash of the original. Um, and I've seen the second remake, probably up in one of my uh, worst movies I've ever seen. Uh, but actually, I just saw Halloween 2 on YouTube. Uh, I I don't know anything, but it seems that the movie is illegal in Norway because it hasn't came yet, not on the cinema or or on DVD. So I don't know. But I saw it on YouTube, and it was pretty bad. But if you want to see some real shit, check out this movie. Uh, Halloween is the best. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed, rate and comment, and we'll see you next time, so goodbye.